Hey everyone, it's Doodle and it's time for another episode of Doodle Days. So this week I've got two questions for you from Tate and they are one. Since your vlog is named as Doodle's Book Vlog, does that mean you doodle in your books or is that just the name you chose? So to answer this question, no I do not doodle my books. I like keeping them in pristine condition. So if I were to give them away or let a friend borrow them or if they're just going to sit on my shelf, I like them in the condition I got them in. So no cracked spines, uh, no bent pages no writing in them. I like having them looking exactly as I got them. I don't know, it's just a tick with me, I guess. Um, so yeah, that's no way the reason why I called my blog Doodle's Book Blog. Um, the reason it's Doodle is because it's my nickname. That was given to me by my ex-boyfriend that I absolutely love the nickname. I just got rid of the guy that went with it. Uh, <laughs> So, uh, why do you call me Doodle? There are two reasons. The first one is my tattoos have all been hand drawn by me, colored and designed and whatnot. And I basically take them to a tattoo artist and say, This is what I want, this is where I want it. Now, here's cash, go put it on my body. That's how it works. Uh, so, I guess that's part of it. And the other part is if you were to set me anywhere, it doesn't matter what I'm doing, if I am. Um, reading a book, watching a movie, watching TV, you know, just sitting in class, it doesn't matter. If you put a pen and paper in front of me or anything to write on, anything to write with, then I will end up mindlessly just doodling on it. So I'll be, you know, doing squiggles, I'll do hearts, stars, butterflies, flowers, anything pretty much, I'll just start drawing. So that's why I got the nickname Doodle, because it's one of the little things that I do when I'm bored pretty much. So. That is why Doodle's Book Blog is Doodle's Book Blog. Um, the next question I have, number two, is what is your favorite book or series? Um, I decided to answer both of these. So for book, I've got two. One of them is contemporary. One is a fantasy book. And then the other one is a uh, series. So my favorite uh, book that is contemporary, I read it last fall. It's a 2012 debut absolutely adored the story. Um, it was a military book, of course, and it is something like normal. I know I haven't put the review up yet, but this book was fantastic. I will be reviewing it soon, I promise. Um, if you love um, contemporary, I highly, highly, highly recommend this book. Um, I read straight through and almost made myself late for class last semester. So um, really, really awesome book. Highly, highly recommend it. Then, um, if, you're, uh, if you were following me on Twitter last week, then you saw me tweeting a bunch of lines out of this book. My favorite book um, just happened, so it just knocked something like normal off the number one spot, which is why I chose both. Um, the book is really good. Absolutely loved it. I actually reviewed it today. Um, it is... Splintered by A.G. Howard. I adored this book. I love Alice in Wonderland. Like, absolutely love, 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 love Alice in Wonderland. Um, so, I'm so stoked I got to read this. Um, I actually ordered a copy for Annabelle at Sparkles and Lightning uh, last night. So, she'll be getting a copy soon. And then I'll be doing a giveaway on the blog in the next few weeks for a copy or two of this book because I love it and I think everyone should read it. Um, so yeah, I reviewed this today. Go check out the review. It's awesome. Um, the ending was really good. It was a little sad and then it perked up. So I'm really happy about that. So I love this book. I think the cover is so unique. Um, so yeah, this is my other favorite book that now is in the number one spot. Then my favorite series. Um, Significance by Shelley Crane, hands down. But um, Jessica Sorensen's uh, Ellen Mika series and Kaylee and Kaden are in close second and third. Uh, I oh, they're so good. Um, but Jelly Crane's books, so um, Significance is being made into a movie, and it'll be premiering on February fourteenth of two thousand and fourteen, which I'm totally stoked about. So her books are beautifully written, absolutely amazing, and each of the books in the series picks up immediately following where the book before it left off. So pretty much you go, you read Significance, and then Accordance picks off the like second after Significance ended, and then you have Accordance that picks up immediately after, or Defiance picks up immediately after um, Accordance, and then Independence right after Defiance. 
absolutely amazing. I love her work. It's stunning stuff, and I highly, highly recommend it. So I'll link up the reviews for that below the blog, also, or below this video on the blog also. So that is it for me this week. Um, I guess for you guys to tell me stuff. If you have a blog, tell me what your blog's name is and why you chose that. And then I also want to know what your guys' favorite books and or series are. I need some recommendations. So I will see you guys next week on Monday for another episode of Doodle Days. And I hope everyone has an awesome week. Doodles out.